What we're going to do here is question one, two, three, and four. The first question is uh, draw a square with a diagonal of 100 millimeters. The line at the angle in the square is to be 100 millimeters. And of course, that's always at 45 degrees in a square. So the first thing we're going to do is set off a line at 45 degrees and then mark off the length required, which is 100 millimeters. So mark the two points and then draw horizontally through those and vertically through them. And that's your square set out. Now just line that in. And that's a square with a diagonal of 100. Now we're going on to question two. We're asked to draw a rectangle with the measurements shown above. So the base of the rectangle is to be 100 millimeters and the side is 55. So the first thing we do is we draw the two vertical lines through the end of the base, set off the height using the compass mark the length on both ends and draw a horizontal line through those two points. And that gives the rectangle that was required. Now we're going on to question three. In this case it's another rectangle. We have 110 base but with a diagonal of 125. So the first job we'll do again is draw vertically up through both ends of the baseline and then get the compass set to the length of the diagonal which is 125, draw an arc and then join across the top and line in your drawing and that's your rectangle that was required. Question four then is draw the parallelogram shown. So with a parallelogram there's two sides parallel, in other words these two pencils they will never meet, the two lines parallel. First thing here in this case is the angle is 60 degrees so we get the 60 degree set square and draw through the two points on the base, set off the height or the length of each of those lines, so 55, and then draw the horizontal line through those two points. And that's your parallelogram drawn. And that's your sheet finished.